So here are the few of the packages that have already came and we have some other stuff for our slime shop and channel. This is not nearly everything that we have gotten, but we just want to unbox some of it right now. We're also going to be organizing these shelves that we are going to be using to store our slime supplies. This is also not the spot that we are going to be making the slime, we're just doing some organizing. The first thing we're going to show is this mixer we got off Amazon. It is quite small, which is perfect for us because we're starting our slime shop off small. It came with a lot of good add-ons like this splatter shield, which is really great for slime because it can get messy. It also came with these attachments. We will be mainly using the hook because that's best for mixing slime, but these could come in handy. It comes with six speed settings and you just press this button and it comes right up. And if you want to purchase this yourself, it's Kitchen in the Box from Amazon. Next, we have our microphone. We received this as a gift, but we thought it would be great for filming ASMR on our channel and for a slime shop. Also, we're thinking of doing it for our new Instagram, so we're going to link that down below. Here is our next package. We have already opened all of this before filming because we are using some of the stuff to test recipes, so it did not all come like this. Let's go ahead and open it up. We have a lot of supplies for making slime in here. First up, we have all of this clay. It is a really great brand and we definitely recommend it. We have used it in our videos before. We have this gold powder. We have already tested this out and it is so good. Highly recommend, it's super pigmented. Next, we have a few tiny containers. These are going to be used for free bonus slimes that we're going to give for some orders. These are not the containers that we're going to be using for our regular slimes. Those have not come yet. Okay, so moving on, we have lots of glue including this glue wall, which is used for slimes like Thick and Glossy. We also have a lot of clear glue and we'll probably need more. And we also have just regular white school glue. We also have some glycerin, which is very important for slime making. Lastly, we just have some snow powder this seems like a little, but it goes a really long way. It makes two gallons of snow mix. All right, that's it for this box. Let's move on. Lastly, we have this box. This one is full to the brim with slime making ingredients and packaging. So first we have these paper shreddings in yellow to fill our boxes and mailers with when you buy a slime. And we also have some candy as extra goodies. All right, on to some slime ingredients. We have a big bag of Big Sue Beads. These are white iridescent. And we also have some smaller bags of foam beads and some extra glitters, glitter flakes. Next up, we have these adorable pig charms. If you checked out our first restock, you probably saw these on our When Pigs Fly slime. They're all different motions, so you get a mystery one. And we also have some bee charms, big and small bees. And we got all of our supplies, or most of our supplies, from Happy Kauai Sl Slime Supplies. So make sure to check them out because they have really good supplies. We also have some scents. So we've got cake batter and lemonade. You'll also see these in our first restock. And some adorable females and sprinkle mixes. 
and some rainbow charms as well as some other sprinkles like these cloud femos used in many of our first resock slimes and these we actually got from a gift there's some extra coloring and scents that we'll be using for our slime shop as well as soft clay we also have our bubblegum scent from our when pigs fly slime it smells so good and really realistic and some other extra charms and sprinkles we can use in extra slimes snow powder this is a smaller amount than we had earlier and some super cute berry charms that came in our gift set so we can use it for extra slimes lastly in our boxes we have our food coloring set it comes with 30 different colors they are pretty small they're they're 180 milliliters no that's not right never mind they're 180 millimeters altogether. You get all these different colors. Just some other things that we want to show is this activator bottle that we'll be filling with activator, of course. This measuring cup, this we'll use for glue and all of that slime materials. And finally, some little add-in packets. These are absolutely the perfect size. We were really happy when these came. They're so cute and perfect for slime. We also got lots of containers to store our slime. This is what we have for now. We haven't filled these drawers down here because we haven't gotten all our stuff. So we might do a little rearranging, but for now, this is what we got. Our order for our containers arrived. We got them from US Plastics. So let's open it up. We did already open this package to make sure we got everything before taking this video. So here are what our containers will look like. They are eight ounce containers and have a very nice and sleek lid. And we also got one ounce containers. They're skinny and tall ones and they have the same lid and with a foam liner in the top. So we've got a big bag of the, of the, Eight ounce container. <laughs> <laughs> so we got a bunch of great containers and lids. And we're ready to start selling slimes. So one thing we had a lot of trouble finding was our perlite beads. These were very hard to find. We couldn't find them anywhere online, but we did find them at Ace Hardware. Lastly, we just got some jelly cubes from Amazon that we're going to be putting in one of our slimes. They are a bit smaller than average jelly cubes, but I think they're just gonna be perfect for the slime we're making. So here we are making our slime. In this video, I believe we were making Somewhere Over the Rainbow, which is a thick and glossy slime with a clear syrup. This is actually one of our slimes that is selling the most right now. While I'm filming this voiceover, I think we've already sold four to five. Since our mixer is so small, we make our slimes in about two to three batches. So yeah, and make sure to get the slime because it's selling fast and it's so satisfying. So right now we are packing syrups for a few slimes. We have had three orders so far and we're just super excited. Two of them were from family and friends and then one of them we got from someone we didn't know. So we're super excited about that. It just is really nice when someone you don't know buys from your shop because they're not just doing it to support you, they're doing it because they actually love your slime. So right now, this is the syrup for A Storms of Brewing. It is a yellow Bingsu slime. I really love this one. And so as you can see in the background, we have packed some slimes for people. 
This is for um, a friend of ours. This is all the slimes that everyone has purchased so far. These four are for a friend. She ordered all the slimes from our restock. These two are for the person that we do not know. I'm super excited about this one. They ordered somewhere over the rainbow and a drop of golden sun. Another friend also ordered the exact same thing, somewhere over the rainbow and a drop of golden sun. Right now we are just taping on the add-in packets so they know which add-in packet goes to which. Yeah. Okay, so now we are packing our borax baggies. We do about half a teaspoon to one half cup of water, normally in our borax baggies. And we just finished taping the add-in packets to the slimes. So each order gets one act activator packet. So here's all the slimes ready to be packed. Thank you so much for watching our first vlog. And if you would like to buy any of our slimes, we are Sunshine Slime Lab on Etsy. The link will be in the description. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.